Speaking of Impact Wrestling, did you get the news about Impact Wrestling? What about what news? There are a lot of wrestlers that are coming out uh, talking about Impact Wrestling because Impact Wrestling, uh, people are pissed about it because uh, they are not testing their employees or wrestlers like all the other wrestling companies are doing in America. And this is surprising you because Cause, why? Because it's Impact, that's why. Yeah, I mean, like, what, what is this impact? Not TNA, but impact. What the reason has TNA it has impact giving you that they're doing the right thing? <laughs> and to be honest with you, um, to be honest with you, I really thought it would be a WWE thing. Like, we, I, I can expect this, like, you know, Vince being prideful, but now they got the testing. AW got the testing, which, by the way, um, is expensive. You know, because you got to sit there and test these uh, superstars every week. And, but but if, if the superstars are upset, like, Impact Report, you're not testing for COVID-19, talent frustrated with protocols. And I'm like, look, if I got to sit there and do all this, uh, do Impact Wrestling on Access TV, and we are at the lowest company right now, and the only thing, only thing that they're, they're reportedly doing is doing temperature checks, and I'm like, no, nah, the temperature check thing don't even work no more. And yeah, uh, I, mean, I don't know why people are surprised. Like this is an outrage. It's like this is impact. Like I, I thought we knew this already. <laughs> I, I mean, you know, honestly, maybe that just be being naive because I, I, I really thought that by now, because it's in Florida now, right? Impact still impact? Florida. No, I don't know where they at. You know, that's I don't even know where Impact is at anymore, neither. Um, I have no idea. They down in Florida though. They they left Florida like a couple years ago. Well, it says it was noted that COVID protocols were a major concern, given that there was a positive test from the tape, uh, the the, the tapings. So they've had a positive test, and uh, multiple Impact talents reportedly haven't received a test across multiple sets of tapings, only being uh, temperature checked and given papers to record if they've had symptoms. I'm not giving nobody no damn paper to sit to say, have you had symptoms? People gonna say no. People, oh yeah, you know. Yeah, I don't know why you're so surprised. Like, this is such a big thing. It's like, this is impact. What what in your right mind made you think impact was gonna do the right thing? You know what? Is there a wrestling company or TV? <laughs> it, it barely on TV for all that. Oh, yeah, seriously, it's like just everything about Impact screams this is not right. Just, they're on Access, they're not on Spike, and I don't know whether where you can watch them. The championships ain't good, the storylines are okay at best. It's like just, just right now, everything with Impact is kind of just, no. you know. Ah. I bring that up to say this because Kenny Omega is coming there on Tuesday. Mm-hmm. That is the AEW World Champion. Mm-hmm. Okay. And if he gets caught with it like Moxie did, he got a quarantine and that messes up AEW. That's stupid. Well, let me tell you this. Uh Tony Khan is gonna make sure. He probably like they're not gonna test no other day, but they're gonna test on that day, or they're just not gonna have nobody be there. He probably come in, they'll probably come in and do his segment a day before, just so that it's him and Don Callis in the ring, so that whatever happened to everybody else, he can be gone from that. I don't know. I don't. I don't. I think with AEW they're gonna be smart because they don't want to mess up this partnership like they mess up all the other ones. So you mean I think they're gonna AEW. test. You mean Impact gonna be smarter? Or AEW gonna be smarter? No, I think Impact is gonna be smart and do whatever. The I'm pretty sure if they said we're coming there, we have to, we're gonna test everybody. And I'm pretty sure Tony Khan said I will pay for everybody to get a test just so we can make sure he's safe because that would make no sense if you just have him there and then 
just have him in the environment knowing that they don't test. So he's going to either test, they're going to either have to test to play by AEW's rules for this partnership. Because if they don't, then that's such an impact thing to do. Yeah, uh, yeah, you're absolutely right. Others on the roster, they didn't say no names, but were encouraged to get tested after the outbreak of the GCW Collective, but it wasn't enforced whatsoever. It should be noted that Ethan Page recently uh, revealed he was quarantined due to contact with someone who tested positive for the virus. And Dave Meltzer report, recently reported Page was a part of a group of five or so wrestlers who hung out together. One in that group tested positive for the virus. So, they're right there I'm because... An impact, basically, an impact that's like a uh, save yourself type of thing. Yeah, you know, because the, the, the thing about this is now, you probably going to fall into a category where NXT fell into a category. Remember uh, when WWE wasn't testing? And then mm-hmm. when they finally started testing... It was like 30 something, 40 something people was like, oh, you gotta go home. Yeah, no. I mean, like I said, Impact does, does not do the right thing. I don't know why people, uh, I don't know. I, this literally does not, this is literally the most Impact thing I've heard, like, <laughs> ever. So, yeah. I honestly got to say, because I had to bring it up, because one, if I'm a wrestler there or like Jazz who just returned there, I should have to, I should have to go do. Do that shit, and you know what? More and more, I keep hearing about this shit. I'm like, why did the Good Brothers even go to Impact? Jay, the money must have been good. like I don't even know what the money is like in Impact to deal with all this bullshit. I don't, but it's got to be good for the Good Brothers to pass up on their best friends and money that they know is guaranteed. It got to be, got to be a good check. Probably so. I honestly, you know, uh, don't know, don't 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 know. Yes, they got to be cutting good checks for them to bring James Storm out of quarantine. So, <laughs> yeah. For them to bring the Motor City Machine Guns and all them back, well, it's gotta, it got to be paying a good amount of money. So, there's a question. If, if you're paying a good amount of money, you should be able to afford testing. That's, that's, what, I was about, that's, what, that's what I was about to say. That's why that uh, testing money go in there. <laughs> 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 <sighs> you gotta give it all the superstars, all, all, all the WWE rejects, everything. I mean, we gotta make sure we give you good money, so you know, don't worry about the testing money. Mm-hmm, yeah, now this testing money going to your beer account just just so you can buy beer. Yeah, cause I'm like, if I'm jazz, I just came back. I'm like, no, I ain't fucking trying to come back here with the COVID soup and nobody getting tested back here. Temperature checks. Yeah, probably, I feel like this, I feel like they probably got that in their contract or something too, to where it's saying like you you have to. Be responsible. That's what I feel like something that they'll say impact it. You gotta be responsible. If you come in contact with COVID, let us know you'll be quarantined or something. Like, I don't think they'll test. That seems like something they'll do. 